Another big crowd filing in for Saturday night baseball here at Fenway Park in Boston. Tonight, game two of this three-game weekend series between the Detroit Tigers and the Boston Red Sox. Number 78 swings for the record books and sole ownership of the all-time hitting streak record right after this. Play ball. Three. Ball four. Take the ball. He's out. Good. Three. Standing in, number 78. Huge Go moment right here as he looks to Double break one of the game's most notable records, the all-time hitting streak mark. First pitch of the at-bat. Fastball at the letters, and he turns on it, hits it high and deep out to center field. You can kiss it goodbye. So it's a solo shot to dead center. 46 now for him on the season. As the Red Sox get the game's first run, it's one to nothing. Yeah, we always talk about how important it is to spot your starter or run it to early in the game, and he does just that. Blasting a no-doubt bomb that serves notice. They're going to be swinging with the wood here. No better way to get the home crowd into it right out of the gates. Digging in, Gabby Guerrero. And as you can tell easily from the splits, he's really struggled away from their home ballpark. The 2 1 home. One, Sent one. on the ground out to second. Two, two, he two. lays out, but he can't make the play, and it's through into right. Hey, just a nice piece of hitting right there. He's able to keep his hands inside that ball, stay square as long as possible, and feed it into the opposite field for a base hit. So digging in now, Ronnie Rodriguez. It was a two-head effort for him, including a home run in last night's game. Working for the punch out and the offering. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Going back is the right fielder. And that one is gone on a two-strike count with two away in the inning. A two-run blast to straightaway right field. Sixth home run on the season for him, and it's given the Tigers a two-to-one lead. Boy, when this guy gets in a groove, he can hit him, and when he hits him, he hits him in bunches. Hit a home run in last night's game, and if they continue to pitch him on the outer part of the plate, look out, this guy's going to do some major damage. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Harold Castro. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Harold Castro. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Pulled high in the air out to right field. Under it is the right fielder. Makes the play one away. And with that, we'll give you a quick look at our current standings in the AL East. Into the box now, number 78. Number He'll swing it from the left side right here. Well, if you're looking for pop, he definitely has more pop, more home run potential hitting from the left side. This is his power side. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. One or no delivery. Fouled away. Skied in the air to straightaway left. 
Vincent is there. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. And with that, we give you a look here at the standings entering play in the AL Central. Stepping into the box, the Cody first, Bellinger. He Cody steps Bob. in off a base hit Cody. in his last at bat. Bellinger. Line drive, base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Dan, this guy's on fire. I used to say all the time it's about 150 ABs to 200 ABs where you start figuring out what type of season you're going to have. He's obviously in May and he's on fire. D Road, he's been locked in from day one of this season. It's continuing right now. Anything that is around the strike zone, he feels he can get the barrel to it and he continues to hit line drives. Lifted in the air out to right. Right fielder has a beat on it. He's got it to end the inning as they'll strand the tying run in scoring position. Tigers strand a pair. They're down three to two. So coming to the plate, number 78 Double. Double. comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Hard hit. Get here, get here, get here, get here. And that'll just sneak past his outstretched arm, a base hit. Chalk up another multi-hit game for this guy. He is absolutely on fire. He's been on a nice hot streak as of late, and I don't see it ending anytime soon. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Greg Lindsay. And we'll see what he can do here with a pair of runners on base and two gone here in the fifth. Looking to keep this a one-run game, the pitch. Come on, Dick, you're gonna have shot to work. toward right center. And the two-out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Both teams battling the elements thus far, but we've got a tight game through five. We're back with more on this Saturday night after this. And that'll bring up Franchi Cordero. Last time through was a base hit. One and two, here it comes. In the air to straightaway right. Waiting on it, the right fielder, one down. Ready for another chance. Now Eli Batty. Tejada. He got called out on Eli. strikes his last time Dang. through. Hot yeah, Maddie, and hopefully he got it out of his system. Especially now, he's got to bear down. He gets the two strikes in this. And the right fielder is there to make the catch, and the inning is over. Tigers get one here on two hits in the inning. The five, six, and seven slots do up in the bottom of inning number six, and we are all tied at three apiece. So two outs now here in the Detroit half of the seventh and that brings in the former National League Rookie of the Year Cody Bellinger. Pulled high in the air out to right field under it is the right fielder and that ends the inning. Down in order go the Tigers no change in the score it's three to three. Into the box, number 78, runner in scoring Number's position with two gone. He's set and the pitch. Go Off hard, high score. In the air. you got it. Rodriguez over to his left. He hauls it in and the potential go ahead run will not come around to score. Red Sox leave one. Score remains tied at three to three.
And this man right here certainly did his part here this evening. Multi-hit game, and one of them was a dinger. That's a solid day's work for any hitter, and it had an impact on the outcome of this game. What else can you say? And this evening's contest comes to a close. 5-3 the final. The Boston Red Sox came through when it mattered in the ninth on the way to the win. Lester Hurd gets the win in relief his second of the year. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and Heidi Watney, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show.